high definition. This is KCAL 9 News at 3. Twitter is and his estate. One of the items most symbolic of Jackson's legacy is the white glove he wore on the victory tour. Remember his nickname, the gloved one? Now it's up for auction. KCAL 9's Dave Malkoff continues our team coverage with that part of the story. Okay, we're here at Profiles in History in Calabasas is the Hollywood auction house where they have things like Indiana Jones's whip for auction. But now, two days ago, they just got a bunch of Michael Jackson stuff. This is Joe. How are you? So this is the glove they saw with the with the Jackson's Victory Tour, and uh, and it actually has some electronics inside of it. Yeah, this glove, you know, it lit up. So the magic of uh, 1984 is there's the illumination that one would see on stage. I would not be surprised if it brought a million dollars. I mean, how many people have put their hands in it besides Michael Jackson? Did I you mean, put your hand, hand in few. it? Yeah, one time. <laughs> yeah, but, <laughs> I gotta do that too. But you think about that, how it's not been, you know, you're one of maybe four or five people who have ever put their hand inside the glove. It's very small fingers. Well, he was a very, very thin guy. And then what's this? This is the fedora. I mean, so this would be his other trademark piece. He wore these fedoras constantly, yeah. and he threw them off stage and stuff. Now, the fedora is much more common because he threw them constantly. Everything that is Michael Jackson is worth something. This is a piece of nothingness. Yeah, this and is it, a compliance it, certificate yeah. with the city of Santa Barbara that Michael Jackson signed in 1992 for weed abatement. This was presented to Michael Jackson to commemorate the sale of 20 million copies of Thriller. This album will stand as the top selling album of all time because people don't go out and buy albums at record stores the way they oh, used absolutely. to. Oh, absolutely. And his record sales have skyrocketed in the last two days. Yeah. You're just looking at his musical career, not his personal life, not all these other things. But if you look at just that part of his career, he's legendary. And the auction is October? October 1st and 2nd. And we'll have a link to that right on our website. That's cbs2.com slash Dave. Also, kcal9.com slash Dave. We want to thank you for You're showing welcome. us all thank this stuff. You're welcome. Thank you very much for your time. You're welcome. Back to you guys. Meantime, there's a warning to Michael Jackson fans. Beware of scam. Soon could be ugly. Yes. Thank you, Jimmy. Mm. Uh, it could be the single most iconic wardrobe item Michael Jackson has ever worn. Up next, the auction for Jackson's white glove. And don't forget, you can get your daily lotto numbers live on our sister station, KKL 9, at 6.59. You know, there's a reason that car... CBS Tonight. Who can forget the white beaded glove Michael Jackson wore during the victory tour in the mid-80s? It's now up for auction at the Profiles in History Auction House in Calabasas. The glove has beads and crystal rhinestones. It even has lights that are powered by a battery. The auction will take place in October. The glove is expected to fetch as much as a million dollars. A million bucks. CBS Evening News is next.